What is Crackalackin' everyone? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another gaming reaction. Forspoken. So they all had a trailer at the Game Awards. I've loved everything so far that they've shown uh, for this game. The first trailer, the, the second one that came out. Um, loving the movement, the graphics, the techniques, the power-ups, all that. Because it was very similar to in my way of like, you know, Bayonetta, Del May Cry, and uh, Final Fantasy 15. It's like a mix of those. So, really excited for this one. Let's see uh, what they show more. Hopefully, a lot of things. And uh, yeah, let's uh, check this out. <laughs> Who are you, child? My name is Frey Holland. I do not know how I got here, and all I want is to go home. She is hell. Oh, strong. that dragon fight is going to be something else. In the corruption. The people are afraid. They look to me in the council for hope that we cannot give them. But maybe you can. Wherever I go turns to shit. It's always been this way. Mm. You know what? Lost. As much as everything the visuals the around, everything is looking good. Yeah. I saw it up close. Whoa. It is you who trespassed on my land. The oh, you so beautiful. Oh, I was about to say the facial expressions need work. They really do. The lip sync also is off, but look at that. The abilities and everything. My headset doesn't want to stay on, but whatever. <laughs> look, Bayonetta. I I would even put like Gravity Rush in there. And Final Fantasy 15 and Devil May Cry. You know, like I would put all those games together. Lies. They had a baby. <laughs> Look, visually, it just looks so good. The world, the power of. And I like the fact that she's in her joggers. You know, because obviously she's from a different world. And they're showing that. May. Ooh, so they have time. All righty then. All right, that was a good trailer. All right, I wouldn't say that was a great trailer, just because, just because the facial animations. I do think they, they need work, but again, I'm pretty sure this is probably not the final, final product. So hopefully, hopefully, this is not. Uh, and they have like about five months to like finish everything off. But other than that. Oh yeah, and even the, like the lip sync, like it was like old school lip syncing, like just up and down. Lips were just moving up and down, and it was like there's no like natural movement there. But other than that, like the the power she's using, the world visually speaking, there's just so much detail. The movement is so fluid. All of that is actually looking gorgeous, it's looking gorgeous, and that's why like the facial stuff was like popping out so much because everything else is. Just amazing and then you look at the facial animations and all it's like okay well yeah that that, that don't look like it. now again i'm gonna go back to it this game is literally a baby of gravity rush if you played it you know exactly what i'm talking about bayonetta devil may cry and most importantly final fantasy 15 i know there was a lot of criticism when final fantasy 15 came out and uh the the way combat and everything was handled but to me, all my life, I wanted a Final Fantasy game like that. So I love that game to bits. Like, I love that game. So when they are doing or something, they're adapting that kind of a gameplay style in this, I'm all for it. You know, I'm all for it because this is literally, I'm, you can tell whatever they learn in combat from that, they're applying that here. Even the, the camera movement, the way the camera is behind her, it's very much like Final Fantasy 15. So I'm, I'm very hopeful. I'm very hopeful. As far as like the, the world and the combat and everything, it's looking amazing. And the story, yeah, the story it seems functional because you've seen this kind of story before where it's like oh it's from another world and savior and all but as so as long as they do the emotional notes right 
we'll have a good game, you know? But if they don't do that, then then we'll have problems. But that's obviously yet to see. We can't really say the story is going to be bad. The game's not out yet. But it's it's a functional story in this kind of a fantasy uh, fantasy game like, like this one. So I'm very hopeful. And I like, I like, lastly, I like the fact that they kept the Snickers like he has or joggers or whatsoever. Because it just shows her personality really is from the real world, right? Usually they're like, oh, you're in the different world. Got to have all that new attire based on the world you're in. But I like that touch. Her, the costume design and everything is more from, you know, where she's from in the real world rather than completely uh, in the fantasy world that she just uh, transported in. So I love that little detail. So that's kind of take on this one. Now, what are your thoughts? What do you think about this game? Do you think this is going to be a hit? This is going to be a mess. Leave a comment below. Let me know. And other than that, I want to say thank you for watching. Thanks for all the support. If you like this reaction, there are a whole lot of others on the channel. Please go have a watch. Yeah, take it easy. Take care. And I'll catch you all soon. Until then, ta-ta. Take -ta. out.